Right, hello everyone, it's Team Rocket Dross here with another Pokemon card opening. And for this video, guys, we're gonna be opening another Gyarados GX uh, Hidden Fates 10 and 6 of these Unbroken Bond Staller Tree Pack. So, uh, like I mentioned before, this is a 10 that I've opened already before. Um, so, I guess we could get started with the Dollar Tree Packs. I think I've opened like three or four of these already. Uh, so, if you guys haven't seen them, make sure to go check it out. Um, I have a link in the description for all my Pokemon card openings uh, and uh, yeah, you guys are going to be able to find them there. But um, yeah, just in case you guys were wondering, we do have two of my tutorials in the back. I have that uh, Mewtwo as well as Ivelta. So if you guys haven't uh, seen those videos and want to learn how to draw Ivelta and Mewtwo, uh, basically those are how that, that's how they end up looking like. So if you guys are interested, uh, make sure to go check it out. So we do have these Dollar Tree packs. Obviously, they're a dollar each. We end up getting a reverse hollow. And uh, yeah, you can find them at Dollar Tree, Dollar General, any Dollar Tree stores that are like that. I imagine there's a lot more different ones. Um, but yeah, they're a dollar, guys. They only have three cards in it and a little like promotional uh, card right there. You got a Cubone, Ryolu, and P Mimikyu. And if you guys were wondering why I'm buying these Dollar Tree packs if they don't have rares or anything like that, and the thing is that there's a chance to actually get them, guys. So I've actually pulled. Um, some good cards out of these uh, ultra rares and stuff like that I actually pulled one recently so if you guys are interested in that make sure to go check out my other card opening videos and uh, yeah just in case you guys are interested so we got a spritzy a lick a tongue and another fairy charm ability and say another one just because I remember pulling that one already and then in the back I also have these three cards that I recently bought um, I'm collecting some of the older cards which are the coast cards and uh, yeah those are just some of my uh, newest add-ons to my collection which is actually really cool two more packs guys i'll be going and buying a few more of these dollar tree packs soon um probably either tomorrow or in the next week or so um want to see what other cards uh packs they have the fairy caterpie so not the greatest pulls our last one hopefully we get something really good before we open open that uh nope oh we did get a rare though Miss Maggie is rare. And then we also got Samson Oak. Which is an uncommon. Not bad. But uh, yeah guys. So now let me actually open the GX10. And uh, see if uh, we can get any good pulls out of it. Alright guys. There we go. I got them out. Here's the actual promo card. Just in case you guys never seen them before. Um, and then here's the code card. So I am going to sleep this baby up. Just because... Uh, it is an ultra rare. I know they're not worth that much. I think it's worth like $2 or something like that. Just because like so many people open Hidden Fates already. And uh, obviously this is one of those promo cards. But it's uh, still cool. It's still a, a Gyarados GX, right? Still a, an ultra rare. Alright guys, so we ended up getting our four packs. We got the Legendary Trio. We got Mew, Mewtwo, and then Shiny Charizard. So obviously the cards that we're going for are for the Shiny cards. As well as that Charizard that everybody wants. Uh, so... Wish me luck, guys, and hopefully we get something good in this pack or in this just 10 in general. So here's the code card. So one, two, three, four. I believe it does. No. <laughs> All right. So these are the four that should be in the back, right? Should be like this. Yeah. All right. So we're going to start off with the coffin. We got a Paris, Cubone, and I ended up dropping the the common and uncommon guys oh we got something good i saw that did you guys see that jill dude i'm glad that's not the one i dropped oh we ended up getting um a reverse fire so i did do this way wrong we got koga's trap as our uncommon we got <laughs> brock spear city gym uncommon we ended up getting a giovanni's exile and then we also ended up getting our energy card so i think i did do it wrong I was way off guys but we ended up getting this uh, reverse hollow um, energy and it's good and bad at the same time uh, it's good because it is a reverse hollow um, energy right but it's bad because it takes the spot of the shiny so unfortunately we're not going to get a shiny but we did get a regular ultra rare and uh, we ended up getting hopefully it's something that I don't have right we ended up getting ooh pincer GX 
I don't have him, guys. So that's actually really, really good. Pinsir GX. It has super power, powered horns, which does 110 for three energy, and then it has the guillotine GX with 160, which is not that much. I expected him to do a little bit more, just being guillotine that uh, move that will just knock out a Pokemon like indefinite, in indefinitely, right? But it's still a really cool uh, card. Like I mentioned before, I don't have it. So it's a uh, add-on to my collection. That's for sure. Um, and I'm also going to sleeve this energy. Just because I do collect them. They're actually really cool in my opinion. And I think I have pulled this. The fire energy. I think I pulled mostly all of them. There's only a few that I don't have. So yeah. It's still, it's still a good uh, card to uh, actually pull. Alright. So now for a second one. Man, imagine I get that Charizard, guys. I'm gonna freak out. You guys are just not. You guys are just gonna freak out with me. Um, especially if you guys have been following my card openings, right? Here's a code card. So, one, two, three, four. Hopefully, I don't. Yeah, I did do it right. So, we're gonna start off with the Psychic Energy. I think I pulled the Reverse uh, Energy as well. Hollow Psychic. Misty's Determination. We got Metapod, Charmeleon, Caterpie, Paris, Charmander, Clefairy. And unfortunately, we didn't get a good card, Slowpoke, because we ended up pulling a Reverse Scyther, which is an uncommon. And for a rare and last card of the pack, it's gonna be a regular rare Mewtwo. Alright, guys, so, hmm. I think for. Uh, favorite art of the pack is going to be or the video is going to be that site there for now if you guys weren't aware let me actually set this aside every video every card opening that i do we choose our favorite art um and then at the end of the video i let you guys know which one was my favorite and why and uh, so make sure to pick out your favorite art guys and let me know in the comment section why and I try to, uh, every time that I choose one, I try not to be repetitive and uh, choose the same ones. So for right now, is that Scyther, because it's actually a really cool Scyther. Just the pose. I think the the shading is not the greatest. It, it has like a color pencil feel to it. Man, I can't open this, guys. I think the Charizard is in there because it doesn't want to come out. It's like, no, don't pull me. I don't want you to pull me. I want somebody else to pull me. Well, too bad, Charizard. I'm pulling you. So here's the code card. Um, just the actual post of it, he's actually really cool. It's just a, like what, like a cool post. If I was gonna draw sight there, that's how I'd want to pull it, right? Like ready to fight. So four, there we go. So our first card is gonna be an energy, a uh, fire, Jinx. We got a Charmeleon, Chansey. We got a Star You, Slowpoke. Man, I'm getting tired of that Slowpoke as well as that Voltorb. We got Pikachu, Ekans. Oh, there we go. We ended up getting another reverse, and it's uh, like a win lose situation. Win because it's a reverse hollow and uh, energy, and it's bad because it takes that position right, that spot. So, our rare and last card of the pack is going to be a regular rare Weezing. Weezing, 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 Weezing. Sorry, I apologize for that, guys. For some reason, I like, uh, yeah, that. <laughs> All right, so now for the last pack, guys. Last pack, Magic. Please give me something good. Come on, Charizard. I don't. I have a lot of these tins, guys, but I don't want to open all of them, right? I want to keep some as a collection, sealed. I don't want to op have to open them because it's really hard to pull the Charizard and some of those shinies. Like I haven't even pulled one shiny in this uh, tin, right? So one, two, three, four. Hopefully we get at least, oh man, I don't know. Uh, all right, we got the energy. We got Lieutenant Search uh, Trainer Strategy, Pokemon Center Lady. We got uh, Sabrina Suggestion, Cubone, Eevee, Clefairy, Psyduck, Ekans. Oh, we did pull it. We ended up getting a revert, a shiny Lucario. There we go, at least we ended up getting a shiny, guys. This was probably one of the worst tins that I've gotten. Uh, although we did get that Pinsir GX, though, and we ended up getting this uh, shiny Lucario. I don't know if I have this one already. I feel like I, I do. Either that or I had Lucario. Or um, not Lucario, but Ryolu. Um, 
I think that one's a shiny as well. And uh, if it's worth more than three dollars, guys, I'll be posting up the price on link on screen just in case you guys are interested in buying this card as well as the 10 you guys saw earlier how much it was i think they're running like 42 dollars right now uh, which is a little bit expensive guys a lot of these uh, uh tents i ended up getting for like around 32 dollars 30 dollars back then um now they're a little bit higher so yeah but we ended up getting this which is really cool guys and then obviously we ended up uh, getting that gyarados gx promo card and then we have these two yeah, these two reverse hollow energy cards, which is not that bad, guys. I think it was a decent um, tin. Uh, finally, with this Lucario, shiny Lucario, like I mentioned before, I know it looks really familiar. I think I already have it, unfortunately, but I could be completely wrong. But yeah, guys, so I think that's going to be it for this video, guys. And our favorite art is actually going to be that. No, nope, it's going to be Lucario, guys. It's actually really cool lucario so all right so the reason obviously it's a shiny guy so it stands out a little bit more uh lucario being uh originally blue i think he looks way better in gold the way it is right now as a shiny um it just stands out so much more um and then it's just really cool the actual hollow to it right it has that like a uh, texture to it and i'm sorry if the the <laughs> my uh, phone is actually trying to focus on it um, it's just really shiny guys and then it's trying to like focus on it. Look at that. It's beautiful. Oh man, this is probably one of my favorite um, actual cards in the set. Uh, but yeah, he actually looks really cool. Just a great Lucario pose. It's a really good one. Um, maybe if it would have been a little bit more zoomed in into Lucario where you wouldn't be able to really see his legs. And then just like maybe, uh, I don't know, maybe like to right here, like around right here. If they would have been just zoomed in the same post and everything it would have looked a lot better right just it would have looked amazing although it still looks really cool like this and then he has like this uh, aura right there that he's about to send out which is actually really cool and uh, yeah i really prefer the lucario uh the golden lucario over the blue one but um it's actually really cool i just like the card overall guys the shiny wise um it's a really cool hollow so yeah guys let me know in the comment section which one is your favorite out of all these and let me know why guys i'm actually interested and i do read all your comments guys or at least i try to there's a lot that i don't get notified of so i might miss but yeah i try to read to all my comments and uh, yeah so let me make sure to let me know which one is your favorite and why also let me know what kind of cards you pulled out of this um on this set hidden fate so yeah guys i think that's gonna be it for this video don't forget to leave a like guys and subscribe for more videos and i guess i'll just catch you guys on the next one team rocket draws out